Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another episode of the Crazy Craft 3.0 SP server series. Hope you're all having fantastic days. Fa fantastic. Yes, fantastic. <laughs> and if you are, hit that like button down below and subscribe for more Crazy Craft content. I know there wasn't an episode yesterday. I missed my every other day spree. I'm super sorry. But we gotta check out what's going on over here. What is this madness? There's just a random glass dome here. And I don't know, I feel like somebody was opening Pandora blocks where they should not have been. At least when I opened up my Pandora's blocks, they were over here. But this is like, open up this, you see, this is almost kind of like the salty shore in a sense. Or I forget what it was called in the first season of How to Minecraft. But you've got Vic's house right here. Then you've got Lachlan's. Then you've got Rob's. And then you've got my house. So we're almost like in a perfect, like, like, so if you look at the map right now, Rob's basically south. I'm west. And then, let's see, Vic's north, and then Lachlan's east. We have, like, a perfect, like, square set up for our homes. And then somebody just goes and opens a circle in the middle of it. And it's kind of like, it's halfway on top of Lachlan's house, so I kind of assume it's Lachlan. Although, I don't know if it is for sure. I feel like it, it was probably Vic or Lachlan. I'm just gonna leave my bae Robert out of this, just, just in case, you know what I'm saying? Alright, so, in the last episode, if you guys were watching it, we made two very key and important parts of Big Bertha. We made the Big Bertha handle, and then the Big Bertha... What was it called? The Big Bertha Guard? I think it was. But what? What? What the heck? Where? where is, okay, hold on. Where is my Big Bertha Guard? I totally made you guys. No, you guys saw me make it in the last episode. Oh, and apparently this cloud pet is like super rare. It even says legendary on it. Apparently Lachlan has been looking for it for like 200 million years, and I literally just found it like straight off the bat. And uh, apparently he was he was not too happy about that. Apparently it's like super super freaking rare, and I found it really fast. And and I feel kind of bad. I feel like I should give it to him. Like I mean, if I should help Lachlan out with this, let me know. By the way, I just I love being a little. <laughs> I was, I've just got this casual tree on my head. All right. No no need to worry or fret. I found the Big Bertha handle. It was sitting here in my personal chest near the bunnies. And by the way, I am totally missing a few bunnies. Uh, I don't know if they've escaped or somebody came over and just like grabbed them or something. But there was definitely three Easter bunnies here. And now there's only one survivor. Stay strong, my man. So now we've got to work on the really difficult part, which is... Okay, by the way, I really want this Royal Guardian sword. And I have no idea how to get it. I have no idea how to actually... I think the only way you can get Royal Guardian gear is in some of the Tier 6 dungeons, which we're going to have to do eventually. But right now, we got to work on getting... Oh, guard. Is that like the... Wait, what kind of guard are we talking Are we talking about like a Royal Guard here? Anyways, like, bogus presser. we got to finish this Big Bertha. We're almost there. Not quite. But the Big Bertha is, what, 500? And the... What was the Royal Guardian at? Was that 750? Oh my gosh, the Big Bertha is not even close to being the best swap. I guess it's kind of close. It's probably like top five, if not like top three or something like that. So Vortex is very easy to kill. These guys are actually really easy to kill. So we need to get a Vortex guy. We need to get a Worm Tooth. And, I, you know, I'm actually not too sure where to get Worm Tooths from. Uh, T-Rexes, which are pretty obvious. I know where to get the Caterkiller Jaws. And then let's see. And then we've got an ultimate sword. We've got, ooh, Sea Viper. Oh, Sea Viper? Oh, those are going to be so... If I don't... I might actually even have some of those right now. The freaking mobs I'm kind of worried about, honestly, is the Kraken, dude. I feel like we're going to save the Kraken for the last because that one is going to be the most difficult one by far. But with all of this, we will finally be able to craft the Big Bertha. Um, also, if my settings seem a little bit weird, we had to do like a bunch of reinstalling on some things. Like my FOV just... It, I don't know. Something doesn't seem right about my FOV. There it is. I was like, man, things just seem a little bit too zoomed in for my... Ah, much, much better. I like to play at 90 field of view. I play Call of Duty at that. It's probably why. I know. I'm a scrub Call of Duty player. Okay, so we can put back a lot of these spawn eggs that we do not need. And what do we do need? So first thing up, if we have T-Rex... I don't think the T-Rex is in here. T-Rex? Okay, no T-Rex is in here. Uh, Vortex? Nope, nope, nope. Okay, that's it. Why, why are we even checking in the small ones? We should check in the big ones. Let's look for the Vortex spawn eggs. And, oh, yep, we got a few in here. And then what about T-Rex chest? Do you have for us the T-Rex chest? Okay, that is not even searching T-Rex anymore. Uh, what is it, man? Okay, yeah, T-Rex. Is it like, is it... Huh, okay, T... Is it like spell... Am I spelling it wrong? I feel like I'm spelling it wrong. Hold on, T-Rex... There's gotta be like a spawn egg for T-Rex. You know what I mean? Like... I don't know why this isn't working. All right, maybe it's just not in here. Maybe it is just not in here. That's definitely a big possibility. Okay, T-Rex. Do you have T... You know what? Maybe I'm just like, is there supposed to be a dash there or something? Is is, is this it? Oh, that's... <laughs> no, that is a t-shirt, Preston. Okay, I might actually have to go and look that up and see what the name of the egg is. Because I actually don't even know. I thought it was just straight up like, 
T-Rex, but that might not be the case. Oh my freaking gosh, ladies and gentlemen, it was this one the whole time. It's T dot space Rex. I was looking up the wrong one the entire time. All right, anyways, the other ones we need are the Caterkiller, which we have here now. Um, sea Vipers, which I think are actually really common. I, I feel like we have the Sea Viper thing, but we'll grab it just in case. And then let's see. So the last one that we're going to need. Oh, the Warm Tooth. Right. I actually don't know where to get a Warm Tooth from. So Warm Tooth or Spawn Mod. I don't look at me. Professional YouTuber Googling while recording. Is it really from a normal worm? It's, it's, really. It's from a normal. Okay, so they must have added it in. Oh, so the Boss Worm. Ooh, okay, so boss worm is where it's from. I don't know if I've ever seen a boss worm spawn egg. Because back in the day, I'm just going to say this right now, they didn't use to drop freaking tooths, all right? So spawn small worm, large worm, medium worm. I think it's the large worm spawn egg is the one that we want. I think, don't, don't quote me on this, but I think this is the one we want. I have, I have actually no idea. We're just, we're going to be able to test this out, though. This will be really, really cool. And let's see, okay, and then we also need the kraken spawn egg. Which is, uh, oh, it's this one. Thank God. I've literally just got one of them left. And we want some Cephadrome spawn eggs, too. I was reading up on, like, the best way to kill the freaking um, Kraken. And apparently, he's a lot harder now than he used to be. Back in the day, I mean, he was pretty hard. I mean, I remember the first time Lachlan and I fought him. It was so much fun, but it was it was pretty difficult, though. We'll, we'll put it that way. It was, it was not easy in the slightest. He was a very difficult character and creature to kill. I think I built, like, a giant trap for him. If you guys want to go watch some, like, OG footage of Lachlan and I. Like, we're talking way back in the day when Lachlan and I had barely filmed any videos together. Oh, also, I was reading the comments. And apparently the reason why my duplicator trees aren't duplicating anymore is because whenever you duplicate an item with them, they'll only duplicate that item until you break the tree back down. So if I want to duplicate specific items, what you have to do is you have to, like, let's say I duplicated, um, like, like, for example, okay, so we've got a bunch of duct tape down here that I was duplicating. If I break, or if I try to break these and place any other type of block, it will not duplicate it. It won't duplicate it until I break the tree down and completely replant it. So, just a little bit of a fun fact, in case you guys didn't know, I kind of learned that. And that kind of makes sense. It makes them a little bit less OP, because that way you got to spend some time kind of like, it's not really grinding, but it's kind of grinding. I think you guys kind of get the point. Oh, and by the way, whenever we go to kill the Kraken... What we're going to have to do is we're going to need to get some raw meat for our cephadromes, otherwise they won't spawn. But I'm assuming that these guys are going to be pretty easy. Uh, the T-Rex and stuff like that. I think we can just range this guy. I don't, yeah, he's not, yeah, he is not nearly as strong as I thought he was going to be. Oh, man, this is, oh, this guy's going to be too easy. All right, come here, Mr. T-Rex. Oh, yeah, come on, let's, let's do this. Come on, and there he goes. So they actually spawned a bunch of uranium and titanium. i got to turn this down. All right, that's it. No. That's every time I try to film on the friggin' Crazy Craft server, it decides the rain, and I'm just, no. I will not have any more of it, Dad but I just won't. It happens every friggin' time. Alright. Enough complaining, Preston. We got we got, we got a job to do. Did we get, oh, we got the T-Rex tooth. Very, very nice. I want to get rid of these spawn eggs for now. Uh, ooh, sea vipers. Can we only spawn these in water? Oh, oh, it's, yeah, of course it, oh, that's the sea viper. Oh, goodness. Oh, okay, he kind of does a decent amount of damage. I did not think he did that much damage. Gosh, and he wrecks the durability, too. Get, yeah, get, get out of here, Sea Viper. I don't have enough duct tape to deal with you. And I don't. <laughs> yes. All right, did we get his tooth? Aha! And we found his tooth very easy. Port to stop. But we actually might be able to use the raw chicken. Oh, the vortex. Okay, I'll keep the vortex. Uh, I'm trying to see what spawn I... I think that's Hercules Beetle. What is this one? Oh, that's the large worm cake. Good thing we didn't get rid of those. Okay, Vortex is very easy to kill once again. Super... Actually, really easy to kill. These guys are actually in the crystal dimension. They're really, really cool, though. Ooh! Oh, is this Irukon... Oh, that's something Irukonji related. But we need the Vortex's... I think that's his eye? I know. Yep, yeah, that is the... Vor that is freaking creepy. We literally just killed a monster for his eye, specifically. That is just strange. And then we got the large worm. These guys are just really annoying because they keep going... They go underground... So, unless you have... Ooh, Sky... Oh, yeah, that's right. They take your gear off. That's right. I remember about the worms being so annoying. You have to be careful because... I... Where's that large worm at? That's the guy we're looking for. We want to fight the large worm. Maybe we should go spawn him somewhere else. Because I think if we spawn him over here, he can just go underground, like, over and over and over. So, maybe we should spawn him on top. Oh, hey. Hey, they see, they took my boots off. What'd you do with my boots? Where are my boots? Oh, those, my those are the vortex. Where did you do with my boots? Dad, freaking gummit worms. What have you done? You demons! Oh my gosh, they're gonna continue taking more and more things. Where are my boots, Dad Gummit? I can't even find them anymore. Oh no, no. You did not just take my boots, did you, Worms? I don't have my boots on and I am salty. Dad freaking Gummit. Alright, I was going to originally leave these guys, but at this moment in time, I don't think I can leave them. After you take a man's boots is when you've gone too far. 
and I don't even see them too. That's the sad. Is, wait, oh, is that? Oh, is that? No, that's not that. That's there's just. What did they do to my boots? They just. Okay, maybe are they holding on to them? I think you have to kill the. There's so many worms though. Hey, don't you guys take any more gear off me? I will freak out if you guys grab any more gear. Get out of here, worms! Come on, give me my gear back. <laughs> this isn't fair, Dad Gummit. You guys are going so far down, you have no idea. I will mine out this entire area. Yeah, that's right. Hey, come back here. Come back here. You little weasel. <laughs> Where do you think you're going? Okay, I think they managed to escape. So all they got was my Sky Striker boots, thankfully, which are like the easiest ones to make. Oh, they're so annoying to make, though. I really don't have to spend the time making them again. <laughs> come here, worms. There he is. Come here. Oh, that's not the large one, though. That's the small one. But I want to see. Uh, hey, where's he at? I think there's one. Oh, there's one over here. Here he is. Come back here. Maybe he, one of them's got it. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? There's one. Hey. Oh, that's the big one. That's Big Daddy Mac Daddy Dragon. Come here, Big Dragon. We're taking you down. <laughs> Get over here. Come back. Don't you think you can run from me? He's bleeding. He's bleeding out. We got him. We got him. Nice job, guys. Although, I don't know if I got my boots back. We did get the tooth, though, which is really nice. But I kind of want to get my boots back. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. It's a ghost. Did he actually take my... Did they actually sandstorm my boots that hard? Because they're def Unless they broke. Did they I, I don't think they could have broke, though. That would have been, like, really, really easy for them to break. Oh, my gosh. Because the thing is, if they take the boots... Oh, see, I feel like one of these little doodle bangers have it over here. All right, that's it, doodle bangers. You guys are getting the... That oh, come here. Come here. Yeah, that's right. We know where the other one is. Yeah, come here. Come here. All right, we got... I think we killed all the worms. So, if they didn't drop the boots, I think they're ripping pepperonis. Don't tell me my boots are ripped in pepperonis, Dad Gummit. Unless you termites ate my boots. Which, you know what? I would not be too surprised if they did. Oh, my freaking gosh. They totally ate them, didn't they? Oh, my goodness gracious. That means I've got to make a whole new set of Sky Dragon boots. Where the heck are they? What are they... Okay, so we need bone meal, which I think we have. Um, the Transformium feet mold... And then the iron ing- Oh my god, which means we have to go get more transformium. But I do know one person that has a lot of transformium on the server, and that is Newt. So I might- I, Oh wait, hold on, wait, I think it- Is that the boots? Is that them? No, it is not. Oh, but there's more worms! Hold on, hope is not gone yet, ladies and gentlemen. Hope is still here. Get out of here, termite. You are such a doodle banger. I can still find the boots. If this guy has them, I don't- Because I don't remember them holding on to them. I thought they just like, unequipped them from you, and then they were gone. It's, ow! Hey! Who was that? Hey, I see you, little worm. Come back here. Where's he at? Let me at him. Where did he go? He dropped pee. Oh, there he is. Is that, was that him? Did the small worm, did he have it? Oh, no, termites. I didn't know. <laughs> termites, I don't want to deal with you guys right now. I'm trying to find my shoes. Have you seen my shoes, Mr. Termites? That's the big deal here. I feel like none of y'all have seen my shoes. Where did this termite hole? Okay, that's it. No, I'm not dealing with termite nets. No, no, just back up termites back up. Oh, there's another worm This is why I forgot how annoying the worms were and that they did this freaking worms Are they just like attracted to them or something? These termites are all over the yo guys get get back guys. I'm trying to kill worms I'm trying to kill worms dad gummit and you freaking <laughs> Little termite doodle bangers are just all over the place. Yeah, have fun inside the hole buddy I don't want to deal with your kind right now. My goodness gracious. Yeah, the Sky Striker boots, I think, are... Oh, wait! We found them! No way were they there, though. They were not there the whole time. I don't know where those things came from. If they were there the whole time, I am literally the blindest bat freaking ever. Okay, so now that we've got this stuff, I don't want to lose any of it. I want to put it back just in case. Because it's very likely we might not come back from that battle. Uh, you know, I mean, it's it's kind of a, a ridiculous boss. I think I've got some, yeah, I've got all room inside of here. So the tooth we need, the viper tongue. We also need, oh yeah, put our handles away. Yeah, those are big ones. We want to get rid of our vortex eye. What was it? T-Rex tooth. And then what else? Let's see. Do, 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 do. I know there's some other stuff. There, ha there has to have been some other stuff. Let me look it back up real quick. All right, Bertha. We need, for the Bertha sword, we need that. Oh, the Caterkiller Jaws, right. So the only thing we haven't killed yet is the Caterkiller, which, if I remember correctly, Caterkillers are giant freaking beasts of awesome monstrosity-ness. We want to be kind of careful whenever we fight those guys. So I'm going to do it kind of, like, further away, like, over here. I think this is a pretty good distance. I'm also going to eat, like, just a precaution, a precaution god apple. You never can be new, too careful, Crazy Craft. Yep, that's the Caterkiller. It is a very scary-looking demon beast thing, which we're, I think we're going to use our... Oh, can we hit it with lightning? Uh oh Oh, I don't think this thing has any- I don't think that has any effect on him. God, he just makes the scariest sounds of any of the mobs that we've fought so far. I think so anyways. He has some terrifying sounds. I mean, 
I'm just so happy the ultimate bow is as good as it is. Could you imagine not having the ultimate bow in Crazy Crafts? I just don't think it'd be possible to win. Like, you just wouldn't be able to kill these characters. These creatures are just so dadgum strong. Like, look at this guy. He's just chilling over here. Oh, no, Mr. Caterpillar. Oh, yeah, get stuck. Oh, can we, can we keep him? Oh, this is perfect. Oh, the Caterpillar's getting the doodle bang. Oh, I'm so sorry. Mr. Caterpillar, what are you doing? We're going to have to go in, though, towards the end whenever he gets low enough. we got to finish him off with the sword. Otherwise, it doesn't count. Come on. Come on. There he goes. And all right, he's got to be low enough now. I think we can go in. Strike squad. Go, go, go. Oh, man, he deals a lot of damage. Go, go, go. Oh, God. Oh, my goodness gracious. Oh, boy. Okay, all right, we can do this. One more hit. One more hit. And we took him out. <laughs> oh, my gosh. <laughs> Rip the durability and all of my gear. Oh, he dropped some. Um, is, is this a ruby hoe? That, he dropped the ruby hoe, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> what a weird freaking drop. Did he drop anything else? Uh, you know, I don't see anything else that he dropped. Okay, all right, so now we've got the Caterpillar Jaws. Let's get out of here. We probably should repair some of our gear. We might even need to consider making some more duct tape for this. I don't know if we're going to need another armor set. I don't remember the Krakens being able to get a lot of hits on you, but if they are, we are ripping pepperoni. So let's just hope and pray to God that that's not the case. So now we've got all of our gear. I'm going to make sure I'm double checking. Yeah, because this is what we need and this one. So we need these two pieces. And then we've got, boom, we've got these five. So things are looking up. We've got a lot of raw beef and a lot of raw chicken. And I'm pretty sure that he takes that. But just in case, I'm going to get my shovel out. And let's see. Oh, you know what we should do? Where do we put that soul? Oh, we put it right in here. Perfect. So we can actually just whip out the cow because, yeah, I don't... Oh, never mind. I've actually got tons in here. <laughs> Hiccups do not come back right now in the middle of the video. This, this is not an appropriate time. I do want to repair, like, all the gear beforehand, though, because I'm feeling... I'm feeling a little bit nervous about this right now. This is this is going to be a dangerous mission. I don't know if we're going to come back alive, ladies and gentlemen. We could win. We could be victorious. We could honestly just get straight up get our doodles banged, which is kind of how I'm feeling this going. I'm, I'm feeling like a lot of doodles are going to get banged, and it's not going to end up pretty. It ain't going to end up pretty, ladies and gentlemen. And we might even, like, we could spawn a queen. Or, sorry, not a queen. <laughs> Fudge, not a queen. We could spawn a prince and princess to help us out during this. But I think we'll just use Cephadrome. I mean, I trust in the Cephys. You, you can't not trust in the Cephys. But let's go a little bit far away. Just in case something dangerous happens to the area around us. I don't want to mess up anybody's houses. I would feel very, very bad. Um, and this is actually, like, a, the Sky Striker gear, man. It's really weak in terms of, deal like, oh, just please... Please, we're going to be relying very heavily on the ultimate bow. And I don't know if we're even going to be... Like, we're going to try to use the ultimate sword as much as possible. But we really can't just rely on it totally. So, let's get some... Oh, if we get a bunch of Cephidromes. Because I think they're neutral mobs. Yeah, they are neutral mobs. I don't know if they attack the Krakens. But let's go ahead and tame one. I think if you just feed... Oh, yep. You just had to feed them like once or twice. And boom. So, this one we own. So, here we go. Oh, no, don't. Yep. And then, look. They go straight after the Kraken. That is awesome. Oh, there he is, buddy. Oh, he scooped us up. He scooped us up. Oh, no, no, no. Get out of here. Oh, my gosh. I forgot how overpowered this guy is. Oh, we're dead. And that is why you don't take on the Kraken. Oh, thank God. Keep inventory is on for some reason. And um, I'm, I'm stuck. Oh, oh, my gosh. We have the spawn. Oh, my goodness gracious. I just realized something. We still have the spawn point. From our little, like, battle dome type thing we did. Well, that was a uh, fantastic first experience. I forgot, you cannot get anywhere near the lower area of the body of the Kraken. Otherwise, he basically just, he, he just, well, I mean, you kind of saw. He, he wrecked you, even though all the Cephidromes we spawned in there. Like, I, th I thought back, oh, I think to get loose of the Kraken, you have to shoot him a little bit. We didn't shoot him at all right there, and I think that was our big mistake. Let's get some more Nitro, because the Cephidromes over there, they might still be alive along with the... Kraken. I think he's still there anyways. Because I don't think he'll despawn that fast. That'd be a really fast despawn. Let's be careful, though. We're, we're going in. The, oh, there he is. I think he's still alive. Otherwise, I don't think it'd be raining like this. Cephys, have y'all seen a Kraken? Cephys? I don't think they've seen a Kraken, which kind of... It's scary. Uh, Mr. Kraken, are you here? You, you, I mean, he kind of killed my body, like, right in this direction. Was it over here or was it over... Oh, it's right here. Yep, there's the red dot. So he was, like, right above this area. Oh, crap. There he is. There he is. He's not gone yet. He's not gone yet. Here he is. Okay, go, Cephys. Cephys, go. Go, my Cephys. Fly and kill this man, this demon. Here we go. Take him out. Cephys, go fight him. Cephys, why aren't you fighting him? Yes, yes, my Cephys. Go, go, go. Don't let this guy. Oh, there he is. He's getting close. He's getting close. All right, come on, Cephys. Come on. You guys have got this. 
Dude, I'm literally just taking this guy on with an army of cephadrums right now. This is so cool. Oh, he's getting very close. Hold on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dude, my cephadrums are my bodyguards. This is so hype. More! More cephis! More cephis! You cannot have enough cephi bodyguard. Oh, we killed the kraken! Oh my god! These guys are legendary beasts! Oh man, just killed the kraken. I mean, I didn't get the morph though, which is the unfortunate part, but we did freaking wreck that kraken right there. Oh my gosh, I didn't, I did not think that cephis were that, like, good against him. But the one thing we're missing now, we gotta find where the kraken tooth dropped, because this stuff, oh, was that it? <gasps> kraken tooth, oh, we found it! Dun, 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 dun! Oh, wait, does Nooch not know what the kraken tooth, is? wait, does he know the kraken? Oh, he doesn't. Oh, <laughs> Kenny's over there. I, 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 I was teaching him how to do it on Skype, but the, um, the Soul Forge mod. And he is, or Soul Shards. And he was like, dude, things take forever to craft. And I was like, yep. Pretty much they take a very long time to craft. Uh, oh, back, back, okay, backpack, what are you doing? Backpack, let's not do this. Let's not play a game. Don't play hard to get now, girl. I'm trying to equip you, but I can't equip you. But wait, I have two, wait, I have two back, okay. Uh, so I don't know if you guys knew this, but the server did have an update on. So I'm assuming, wait, how do I have enough, okay, something is screwy with the server right now, we've been having a few server issues lately, we did some updates on stuff, because I think some of the mods were removed in crazy, it was only like three or four, don't worry, it wasn't a lot of mods or anything like that, but we did have some removed, and I think it's kind of like screwing around with, <laughs> I think it's screwing around with the server. Is he, are, are you talking, are you, are you talking, I don't think he's talking to me, I think he's talking to Nuge. Alright, so we now have every, how exciting is this guys, we can craft the big birth, I did, just did not know that the freaking Cephadromes are so strong. Like, I think it only hit the Kraken like five or six times and he was dead, like the Kraken has 1000 HP if you guys didn't know. So, uh, in my experience with the Kraken, I mean he pretty much, I mean you saw him, he, he killed me. He like pretty much one banged me, he gave me zero places to stand that was insane but we actually have to fix our ultimate sword here yep fix it with some duct tape and now we should be ready to go this is so exciting um do i i don't even have a craft bench. oh i don't need a craft bench because we have this boom big i see i don't understand why i have more big bertha pieces than i'm supposed to have i keep like i was losing earlier i was losing what, what was i missing i was missing the big bertha guard and then I found it in my chest, and now I'm missing, uh, I, I mean, I have extra freaking Big Bertha handles. It doesn't, uh, I don't understand why this is happening to me, because I definitely should not have this. I'm going to go, I'm going to find a place to burn this late. I don't have a, wait, oh, wait, can you burn it like this? I don't think you can. I'm about 900% sure you can. Oh, God, what's that? Oh, I thought I threw out some kind of, like, important piece of item. <laughs> I will torch this later on, because this is definitely not supposed to happen. This is probably something to do with, like, a server duplication or whatever. But now that we have all of these items, like, can we just get some hype right now down below in the chat? And by the chat, I mean the comments, because this is awesome. We are making big freaking Bertha. And I am very excited. I'll go ahead and get rid of this handle, and I'll, I'll use this one. I mean, it doesn't matter. They're really kind of, like, all the same thing, right? Oh, yeah, sorry. Forgot. Totally forgot. We've got to craft this first. So let's see. What do we need to do here? We got the eye in the top right. We got the tongue, the sword in the middle. That's an easy one to remember. So we got tooth, tooth, tooth. We got the triple tooth right here. Triple tooth with Kraken tooth, T-Rex tooth, worm tooth. Okay, and then Caterkiller jaws down here. So boom, we got everything. I think I can remember that. I'm not as tired as I was once before. We got Caterkiller down here. This guy over here, Kraken tooth up here. And ladies and gentlemen, I think we now have the Big Bertha Blade. G freaking G. And with a little bit of craftsmanship, we have Big Bertha! Woo! This is awesome! Oh my gosh, I'm reliving Crazy Craft, like, from back in the day. Look at this thing. Look at it. It is so handsome. I wonder if we could go kill Kenny. Woo! Big Bertha! This is so sick! I want to test it on a Pac-Man. I, I, that needs to happen. You guys know of my hate for the Pac-Man kind. Like, I've had so many dad gum issues with the Pac-Man. Killing me over and over and over repetitively. And you know what? I, wait, maybe we have a Pac-Man spawn egg. I, although I don't think those can be spawned in like that. Mm, you, you, hmm. You know, I might actually have to go look that up. I, let me go Let me go look at freaking... Every time I see Jaeger's house, I just kind of cry a little bit on the inside because it's so much better than mine. And it reminds me of how much more work I need to do on my episode, which we have to do a ton of work. Don't worry. It, it, it'll, it's coming. It's coming. Oh, I think this... What kind of... Wait, what ores are these? These are... Oh, I, my heads-up display got disabled whenever we did the new update on the server. We had to, like, completely delete all of our settings and controls. It was really frustrating. But I forget how to enable it again. It, it's somewhere in the options it's in here and is it item subsets maybe it's this I, it's one of these things but you can toggle it on 
so that it shows like is it tools no it's not okay it's definitely not tools the inventory i forget what it's called dad gummit it's it's oh my gosh i forget what it's called i'm trying i'm trying to remember this i'm trying to remember this what is this oh my goodness gracious what is it? it's not this part it's not this yeah this you want to stay in recipe mode oh my gosh i can't remember guys it's is it layout style it's Minecraft. It's oh man, what is it? What is it? What is it? Oh, it's one of these, I think. No, it's not one of these. Dang it! What is it called? Ah, I'll have to ask Choco. I know Choco knows what it is. I'll, I'll find it. But it's basically whenever you hover above the block, it says what block it is. And I totally forgot how to do that. I'm very, very sorry. I think it also does it with mobs too, and it tells you what like you know mod pack they're from, which is really, really cool. I want to find a pack, man. Oh, a crack! Yo, boys, I think this was fate. We just found a legitimate kraken. All right, that's it. You think you're tough, kraken? You think you're tough? Let's go! I'll take you on, buddy. Where, where'd he go? Where'd the Kraken go? Where'd the where, where Kraken at? There, there he is! Let's go, Kraken! Let's do this! Boom, boom! Oh my god! We just two shot the Kraken! Oh man! Alright, so if that doesn't tell you guys how strong the Big Bertha is, uh, I don't really know what will because we just freaking wrecked that Kraken. <laughs> that was awesome. Oh, and an experienced chest plate. I forget what experience does. I gotta remember. I gotta like honestly look that up again. Did they drop? Was that a looting? Fo oh, that's um, wait. I'm breaking four. I didn't even know what breaking four existed. Okay, let's see. What else did he drop? Did he drop anything else good? We got an experienced sword down here, and ooh, and it's got wait. It's got double on breaking on it. I, I totally did not know that was a thing. We have so many ink sacks from killing. Ooh, a looting five sword. <sighs> Ooh, dude, we have those on cosmic, and those things are really, really good. Looting three. Ooh, I'll take that. It's not, I mean, it's not looting five, but I, I forgot. I've got to look up with the exp I think it's if you're running a full experience set, you get some kind of buff. I honestly, like, you know, I just cannot remember. I'm going to keep this, so I'm going to keep the Kraken Tooth, because we might need another one. You, you honestly, we have, I have no idea what we might need it for. But in the in the case that we do need it, which is very possible, I'm gonna go and take it. Yo, big big Bertha just two shot a kraken. Literally hypest hypest of hype, and I, I totally misspelled that. Hypest of hype. Like that's insane. I, I really didn't think it would like two shot it. That is insanely strong. But ladies and gentlemen, that is going to be the end of today's episode of Crazy Crab. Not sure why it turned into a very um, uh, old southern right there. I mean, I am from the south, but not that quite far south. <laughs> hope you guys have a awesome day, and I hope you enjoyed the episode as well. I thought this was a really fun episode, but now the real challenge comes. Fix up the house and do a lot of projects. Let me know what you guys like to see me do first. It could be like a mod. It could be like a house project. Honestly, it could be anything. I, the thing I like about this series more than I like about like parkour and one-off videos is that this video or this series is kind of like one of the ones where you guys get to guide my footsteps in the direction of the series and like where we do things and how we handle stuff. So I really do look forward to everybody's comments down below and all that wonderful stuff like that. So everybody have an awesome and safe day. Take care. And I'll see you all in the next episode of Quazcraft.